Hello, guys. I have a problem with Nathan Thompson. I mean, of course, it goes goes way back, fly earth and everything. But the problem I have today is that he is blasphemous. He's blaspheming God and the Bible. He's saying that the Bible preaches flat earth. The Bible does not preach flat earth. God is not stupid. Because when you say the Bible preaches flat earth, what you're saying is the Bible is a stupid book. You're saying that God is stupid. That God doesn't know his own creation. That is blasphemous. You're blaspheming God. And flat earth is largely based in biblical literalism. You're taking what the Bible says literally. Um, except for the parts that disagree with your, your cult. Your cult-like theory. We all know you have an echo chamber with a hundred and something thousand people. No one cares about that. It does not make the earth flat just because you have a group of a bunch of idiots who don't know science. Or who... Um, who converse about science and then you immediately mute and block them you have an ego problem nathan you immediately mute and ban people anyone who brings up any sorts of momentum in conversation you stop right then and there anyone who makes up a great point but they say you guys don't understand physics and then goes on to explain physics you ban him you're an asshole nathan you're you're you have an ego trip you're you have an egotistical trip right now you're on a power trip you love the attention you don't have a dad you're literally a bastard you don't have a dad you act like a guy that doesn't have a dad. You act like a little boy. The earth is not fucking flat, you idiot. Okay? You are so stupid, Nathan. And how dare you blaspheme God like that? The earth is not flat. God is not stupid enough to believe your nonsense. You have created an idol amongst yourself. You have an idol that you pray to. You have it written on your shirt. You have it written on your hat. You talk about it nonstop. Flat earth is your God, Nathan. It's an idol. And it's a cult at that. It's a cult with you at the center as an egotistical maniac at the head of it, directing it where to go. And we see curvature. We have observable, measurable, provable, provable curvature. And you refuse to see it. You refuse to believe it. You say, all those pictures are fake. But check out these pictures. Check out these memes that say stupid things that I believe in. You're an idiot, Nathan. Let's see. What else? Um, I want to mention another thing. Stop bad-mouthing whole brain power. I'm gonna make a separate video about this. I've had a number of number of people say Nathan Thompson bouncing on a golf ball. He's so stupid. What is he doing? He's crazy. You're making whole brain power look bad. And for anyone who doesn't know whole brain power, you bounce a golf ball on a sledgehammer. It's a legitimate workout. It's a legitimate brain training workout. And that's how I know Nathan from six, seven years ago is we both do this brain training workout. But because he's into flat earth, what it says is I don't want to do whole brain power. That must be for crazy people. Whole brain power must be crazy. Bouncing a golf ball on a hammer must be crazy. Think of an outsider. An outsider that's not Christian. You, know, you preach the Bible all the time. You preach Christianity. But think of an outsider and they hear the Bible preaches flat earth. They're going to go, oh my God, the Bible is a stupid book, man. I'm going to go back to atheism. You're turning people away because of your idol of flat earth. The Bible says to have scripture written on the door frames of your house, on the gates. Um, on your walls. What you're doing is you're putting flat earth scripture, water doesn't curve, all this all this stuff on your shirt. Um, the equidistant map on your shirt. You're, you have idols before. You have pictures, you have words that are idle. Flat water, uh, water doesn't curve, there's no curvature. All this nonsense, it's not true. And you make a video mocking me because I say you can see plants with a telescope, which you can. And then you show up some stupid meme of out of focus blobs. Those are not planets, Nathan. You have an egotistical, maniac midlife crisis right now. You're 33 years old. You have ruined your life completely. And I have no sympathy for you. You've completely messed up your life. You will forever be known as a flat earth idiot. You are famous for being an idiot. Everyone in the whole entire world knows that flat earthers are stupid. The only people you flat smack, which is just you regurgitating all the nonsense you've you've acquired and memorized all those people you flat smack only the most gullible stupid ones fall for flat earth anyone with a brain walks away from you and doesn't even give you the light of day you're a waste of life nathan you should have been aborted